from the city that doesn't sleep, doesn't stop drinking, and doesn't stop for pedestrians, live from New York's Get a Life Stadium, it's Threats Football. I predict a high body count and a lot of shattered limbs today. Yeah, my last game here, my brain got battered. Spilled all over Manhattan. To live in this town, you got to be tough, 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 tough. Hey, what I'm this game is going to be a wholesale slaughter. Mad, no most. discounts in the I'm NFL. I'm bad, the team storm the field. The like insane Colts go up against go. the ass. New York Threats. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. It's time to tune in, turn on, and drop what you're doing because NFL game day is on the air. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. So what's the game plan for the home team today, Bricks? Uh, I think they got to keep it simple. A little cough syrup, maybe smoke a little untidy pod pregame so they can keep their heads in the game. I mean, literally. You don't want to get decapitated on the opening kickoff. I say go after the refs early and often. No mercy. That's a nice gain of about seven yards on that run. Second and three. And this guy is supercharged. Oh, he was hitting mid-hurdle and fumbles the ball. He's at the 20. He's at the 10. Touchdown! She took advantage of the 50 bucks a head prom ticket. <laughs> I'll tell you that. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sitters. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. They need a good return here to set up the offense. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Oh, that's a vicious hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. Second down, the size of Brick's wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. a gain of 10 yards. Second down in inches. And that'll bring up third and one. footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Now this one's going to be tough. I hope he has a good enough leg for this one. I saw him trying one on before the game. He looked okay, I think. Not my type, though. A little too mutilated. And it's good. You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good. Huh? I mean, can't we all just... Not this shit again. Prince, I'm stopping it right there. The home 
team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. Pow! With the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. Second down and ten. Ouch! Anyone in the mood for a steak tartare? Third down and five. Throwing a pick, I suppose. Hey, yeah, man, I was hitting on the now. You know what happened? Yeah. <laughs> they are going for it, and the defense is licking their mutant lips. The nastiest dirty trick. Wow! It's like a mobile crashing into a slaughterhouse. They run it on fourth down and pick it up. That's four new downs and some big, big baboon balls. Graham, did you just say big, big baboon balls? Yes, I did. Nice. And it's first and ten. And it's first and ten. Second down and six. They're back up here on first, and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. <laughs> first down in a mile. Nobody can touch you an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, Bob? Second down in a mile. Third down in forever. This 
offense is rolling. Play bowling. I want Sean Kick to make a kick like this with his extra leg. He used it like a golf club. That wasn't a leg, you moron. That was Tripod Jenkins. He goes right through. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And it's first and ten. Shave a few days off his life. It's anyone's game at the end of quarter one. Second down in a very lot. was good for 10 yards. And that'll bring up third and one. And this guy's running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. And it's first and 10. up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. Six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. You gotta jump over those mines or steer clear of them. Field goal is certainly within the kicker's range. It's good. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when. And it's first and ten. Oh, the strawberry fields dirty trick. As my mentor Hunter used to say, I don't advocate drugs, alcohol, narcotics, or insanity to anyone, but they've always worked for me. Second down and a lot. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah. And it's 
first and ten. Second down and long. He's supercharged and can electrocute any opposing play. Oh, he fumbled that one. Everyone loves being on the highlight reel, leaping over a defender, but sometimes you get hit hard and have the ball knocked loose. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kicker. This guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip work. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And it's first and ten. And the defense gives up five yards there. Second down and five. And we're at the two-minute warning, folks. Stay tuned for the halftime show. Second down and five. First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. They stop the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. Talk about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Second down and 10. Sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money. They use their second timeout, but they are running out of time. A uh, bit pessimistic, don't you think so, Grim? It's more about building tension, Bricks. That's all we do at this point. And drink this bourbon. Give me that. And that was a perfect pass, and he scores handily. <laughs> well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. The runner pulls out a chainsaw.
Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmicks. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the quarter. We are set to go, Bricks. Oh, boy. Where are we going, Graham? A carnival? Huh? I'm going to go to a strip tea show. Where are we going? Yeah. Hey, why don't you settle down? Just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Just pet your rabbit. <laughs> Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. First down and forever. And they went to the air and came up big. Second down and five. And the defense spiked the offensive water with Strawberry Field. And now they can taste sound, but can't remember what the concept of time is. Third down and, well, good luck. Oh, that'll trim your nostril hairs once and for all. Well, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. He's got the ball now, and he's going to try and score. Oh, no one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Maybe the QB 
should throw it and catch it too. Third down and the offense needs a miracle. Guy's gonna get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is a palm grim. That cross stitching, unbelievable. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. Quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went in the woods. Hey, you kill a ref. It's not murder if they have it coming, right? Take the hit. Do something about that ref, you pussies. This is a first and offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down in a mile. You know the defense wants some payback after that. Second down and more than the QB would like. Hey, did your mother ever tell you don't run with a tree girl? If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. A rutabaga after that hit. Baker, man. You get up my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna it. And it's first and ten. And he'll pick up seven yards on that play. Second and three. Yo, man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Third down, and the punter is warming up. He should have had that one. Thank God he's still got his leg. He's going to need all of it for this kick. He is automatic. Nice kick. Boring. Just getting the points and let's move on. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Once. 
Second and three. And that'll bring up third down and seven. And this guy looks Thor under a vent. Oh, and the defender knocked the ball out when he was in there. It is a fumble indeed. Fumble Banji, the new game from Wilton Crabtree. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. That's the end of three, and it's anyone's game. Hang on tight. The fourth quarter is about to begin. And it's first and ten. Remember, folks, in the NFL, you are allowed to touch the quarterback. Just like that. Second down in a lot. And that is called for a first down. And it's first and ten. That's how you run the football. A pickup of seven on the play. Grim, why is it that more mentally disturbed clowns don't play football? They'd be good. You know, they're all in politics, apparently. <laughs> oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. The defense called a one-speed dirty trick. Man, look at him go. really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, that, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. He's leaving it all out on the field today. And there's his large intestines over there, his liver. I think his spleen is stuck on that guy's cleat. No, that's a gallbladder. Ah, uh, my bad. And it's first and ten. That's how you get your buzz on in the NFL. Second down and ten. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Third down and five. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch 
which is a bit slow. They run it for a yard. Second down and nine. First and ten. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self doubt, but he seems to work through it. See that boot, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that. Should be an easy chance to extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back to fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked down? Put in. Run. Oh, with a punishing hit. First and ten. Watch out, the ball is on the field. He was stuck at the line of scrimmage. So is that cheerleader. Second down and ten. Sounds they'll have to regroup during this timeout. Third down, and the punter is warming up. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. Say what? Come on, man. You can't hang with me. You get my grill, I'm going to ruin your world. You understand me? Under two minutes, a timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. And it's first and ten. Kaboom! And the quarterback unleashes a sonic blast again, and he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands. A timeout is called by the quarterback. They have one left. And the hurry-up offense wears out the fence since they can't rest their players. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! And they line up for the extra point. It goes right through. You know, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. And this 
guy is making a name for himself tonight with a pickup of about 10 on that play. Hey, it makes up. And no more timeouts. The D needs to stop. This is intense. No, Grim. Camping is intense. <laughs> Get it? Idiot. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. You know, you got to put the buzz saw in the MVP conversation, Bricks. Got more kills than anyone in the league right now. Yeah, you make a good point. Third down and a pussy here. Man, oh man, he hit that line the way your wife hits the all-you-can-eat buffet of crab apple trees, Bricks. Ah, uh, you're telling me. She ate 47 Salisbury steaks one time. Thought she had food poisoning. Turns out her low intestines just exploded. No, that's a relief because there's nothing worse than food poisoning. Ah, uh, you're telling me. He blasted and picks up seven yards right there. Second and three. The Threats get smacked down today and lose the game. They battled hard but didn't have enough to get it done. They choked like a bunch of banana choking chimp chumps choking on a bag of chimp dicks. Did you just say choking on a bag of chimp dicks? Yeah. God, that was beautiful. Hey, man, nobody can touch you with eyeball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about? Grim Glitro with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microheart Corporation. They get it right every up.